Selling Sunset Star, Chriselle Stiles, I think that's how you pronounce her name, declares love is about chemistry, not height, as she weighs in on dating shorter men amid Jason Oppenheim romance. So apparently, uh, the 40-year-old, who was taller than her boss, turned boyfriend, Jason Oppenheim, added that the focus on stature is ridiculous in this day and age. This day and age? Okay. Cool. I mean, I I mean, I appreciate her, you know, saying that. But the fact that she's got to say that, you know, it's 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 so funny when like when the truth comes out about like what the sexes are into, you know what I mean? Like Roger Federer when his wife is way thicker than him. And I think somebody asked him like, you know, what, uh, well, you know, she's not a model, you know, you know, people wonder why you're with her. And he's, he's like, I just like, I like thick women. Like, I like, and they're like, oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Yeah. It's like, dude, just let the guy like what he likes. You know, women, women who like taller guys. It's just, it's like, I can understand why you would like a taller guy if you think that like it's for like protection or something like that. But like I know guys shorter than me that would beat the shit out of 90% of people bigger than me. So, you know, I mean, it just it, it kind of lets you know like what women actually don't know about men. Because it's always tall guys who like have more confidence and you know it's probably based in you know fake it's fake confidence but it's like taller guys have that because i think at the end of the day i know a lot of tall guys who think that who, who've never wrestled or been a part of like combat sports always think that they could they can beat up somebody who's smaller than them just because they're bigger than them like that's that's the, the their limit to what they understand about uh physical confrontation it's funny it's interesting, uh, but it's like you always gotta you always gotta check those guys, you know. That's all my all my issues, all the fights I get into, seem to be with taller guys, because they 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 think one thing that ain't true when it comes to me, and I'm just the last guy to be like. accepting of that that's just one thing i don't you know you know what i i just don't like it's like when people like start making fun of religion like i don't care what your religion is or if you're anti-religious when you start making fun of it i understand that you don't understand the history of it you don't have to agree with it but you don't understand the history of it you know what i mean uh it's like it's like when people it's like when a vegan Starts making fun of people who like to eat meat. Or like disrespecting people who eat meat. It's like, do you know what we are? Do you know that we are uh, mammals? Do you? Do you know the history of like how we've, you know, gone from Neanderthal to where we're at now? You know that? Are you aware at, at any of this? So anyways, back to the article. Her comments came after she was asked about the recent exchange between Tom Holland and Zendaya, I think that's how you pronounce her name, during an interview on the radio where they discussed the actress being taller than the actor. Oh my God, it's so ridiculous. What year are we in right now? How old are we? She told TMZ on Friday. The reality personality or television personality then expressed that she valued a potential partner's personality much more than their height. Oh my God, it's shocking. Jesus. Everyone's entitled to their own opinion. I just think it's more about what's inside. This is highly controversial, okay? Don't you dare talk about someone's insides. Staus added, I do not think some people have their preferences, but I think it's silly. I do think some people have their preferences, but I think it's silly. It's so ridiculous. Cool. 
The real estate agent made a point of expressing that a potential partner's behavior was a better indicator of an ideal match than height. Wow. Wow. That's some, uh, that's a little bit of wisdom. (laughs) People will be shocked. I honestly think that the height thing is so ridiculous. I just think it doesn't matter. It's about how they treat you and if you guys have chemistry. The media personality went on to express that I think the height thing is overdone. Stouse was then asked about women who would not want to date shorter partners, and she stated, that's their prerogative, but they're missing out. Cool, you know. God defend your choices. Stouse was then asked about women who... Yeah, the the performer in Oppenheim... 44, initially met when when she joined his real estate brokerage, the Oppenheim Group. Prior to becoming involved with the entrepreneur, the actress was married to Justin Hartley. Oh, shit! With whom she tied the knot in 2017. Justin? The Green Arrow? From Smallville? Dude, this is messed up. The two went on to separate two years after they held their wedding ceremony, and they finalized their... (laughs) divorced this past February. Stiles and Oppenheim's relation was entirely professional at first, and he notably told Page Six that dating a co-star probably wouldn't be an epic idea. The two went on to shock many of their fans when they went Instagram official this past July. The actress spoke about the early stages of her relationship with Oppenheim during an interview with E's Daily Pot, where she noted that she wanted to maintain their privacy at first. Okay, cool. Wow. Very fascinating. It's just one of those things. You don't want to share with everybody and get all their opinions before you really know what it is. Stiles recalled that she and her boyfriend kept their relationship away from the public as long as they could have before going public. We really, we really, we really were really private. (laughs) Secreted for as long as we could until we realized the walls were closing in. (gasps) People were getting a little savvy to it. The actress then expressed that she and Oppenheimer made their relationship known after having become comfortable with their statuses as public figures. We made it to a point where we're, where we're really happy to share it because we knew exactly what it was, so it's all good. Okay, so now with context, I get it. She was she married Justin Hartley. Here's the thing. This is the truth about Justin Hartley. Nobody will ever tell you this because this is my my personal interaction with Justin Hartley. I was in Ralph's. I had just moved here. I had just moved to LA. I was living in Studio City. I was sleeping on the couch with some guys from film school, and um, would that was a crazy that was a crazy three months. But anyways, I go into Ralph's and I look up and I see this tall ass dude walking towards me, dressed to the nine. I mean, just looked like he just walked out of a uh, a photo shoot for GQ and uh, the fall edition. I think he had a like a turtleneck sweater on jeans and boots uh and i was like oh shit he's tall as fuck that's justin hartley and uh yeah i mean we we didn't say anything to each other um but dude the guy is tall so now it makes sense now it makes sense uh that this is a a thing i guess because he was so tall but these guys i mean they you know who knows how, I feel like LA, LA, you know, what is it, permeates through people in LA, like the Hollywood, Hollywood permeates through people and it, you know, it kind of erodes people's personality and character and you know, you see kind of like, you know, there's the side of them that you wouldn't have seen if they didn't live in LA, um, maybe, but uh, so who knows if, you know, These Oppenheim guys are, you know, less L.A. than an L.A. actor. But you could probably assume that, right? Um, So it seems like uh, that's what's going on. It's crazy that I'm even talking about this. I don't give a, I don't give a shit. But women who date taller guys, that is a, that is a strange thing, you know? But guys, guys don't date. Guys don't date too many taller women. If the guy is over five, if the guy's over five ten, probably. 
I feel like that's the thing. Let's see who. Uh, let's see how tall Jason Oppenheim is. If I'm right, <laughs> first thing height comes up. He's five three. Oh, okay, got it. He's five three. Chrishell Staus is five six. Well, I was right. He's not over five ten, so he's dating someone taller. That makes sense. She's five seven. Justin Hartley is six two. And in heels, I can tell you he's six seven. Okay? He's a staggering 6'7". Now, I've worked out at the gym with like around him before, and he's not as tall. But when he's got boots on, the old bloke's about 6'7". All right, so this makes sense. I should have gone into this article knowing how tall he was, but now I do. <laughs> Good for you, Jason. Good for you.